In this video, let us try to understand the important mathematics topic that is trigonometry. How to calculate sin theta, cos theta and tan theta using the Excel. So if I directly use the formula in Excel, sin bracket open, it is asking me the number, not the angle. So we have to convert this degree that is angle into radius. So before starting with Excel, let us try to understand some basic concepts of of mathematics that is trigonometry. So we already know in mathematics that 2 pi radians is equal to 360 degree. Okay, We already know this. It is equal to 360 degree that is nothing but your one circle. Okay. Now if I want to get only pi equal to pi radians is equal to how much? 360 by 2 that is 180. 180 degree. So we know this. Now if I want to calculate 1 radian. How much is 1 radian equal to? 180 divided by pi. So that is will be our 1 radian equal to. Now if I want to convert 1 degree then 1 degree equal to how many radians? 180 equal to pi divided by 180. Okay, so this is the basic concept of mathematics which we have to know. Okay, okay. so we know that how to convert the radians into degrees and degrees to radians. So for our formula, so how to convert degrees to radians? We need to have the number of degrees into pi by 180. That is nothing but this formula. Okay. So let us do it here. I am inserting one column here. Okay. So let us convert it to multiply with pi by 180. Okay. So let me convert it this into the angle into pi divided by 180 okay i am getting zero here and let me drag it so this is what is the when we multiply with pi by 180 okay now let me insert one more column and use our excel formula Okay, we have done multiplied with pi by 180 with our mathematics formula that is 1 degree is equal to pi by 180 radians. So here for conversion into radians, let us do directly use the Excel. Okay, equal to radians tab bracket open. Let me put the angle, close the bracket, enter. Now let me drag this. So we got the same. So we can directly use the Excel to convert the degree or angle into radians. Okay. Now let us put it in a sine theta. Sine bracket open D2 that is our radians enter. Okay. So just drag it. We are going to get the sine theta angles. Okay. Now we can directly also use it. Let me use this for cos bracket open into radians of directly the angle okay so i can do this directly also okay without converting into radians and writing it i am doing this directly here let us now let us calculate for the tan equal to tan bracket open radians tab bracket open directly entering the angle bracket close enter okay let us track for other angles 30 45 60 and 90 okay since tan 90 is some long number so it is showing like this okay let us continue this trigonometry formula to find out cosec also Okay, now we already know what is a cosec. It is a reciprocal of sine. So equal to 1 divided by 
sine theta okay so it is not defined let me drag it for the other values okay these are the other values of cosec let us do it for sec theta so sec it is the reciprocal of cos let us drag it for other formula and let us take it for further for the tan that is cot this is the reciprocal of tan not defined for tan 0 let me drag it for further okay so this is how we calculate for the cosec second cot theta also